Good morning, folks. Richard here. How are we doing this fine morning? Um, sorry to disappoint my viewers and so on and so forth. Um, I did promise you um, uh, that I would go through this uh, step by step with you, mighty fine folks. And uh, there wasn't much to this build, okay? So let's go over with. Uh, we attached the four planes, okay? <clears throat> And um, I had uh, two choices, either uh, open, uh, movable, or open. I decided to model them open, because who plays with their models like Norm says, okay? Uh, periscopes, uh, they do go up and down. Uh, they will be open when we visualize them. Screws turns, the rudders turn, and so on and so forth. Can't do that right now, because we're masked uh, for paint. Uh, relatively easy build, and... Um, there was nothing much, okay? We had to install the uh, four movable uh, missile hatches. Okay. A movable power, uh, the rudder assembly, the after uh, dive plane. Uh, and that was it. And outside of building the stand for it, um, it wasn't much to build. Uh, she's all primed and ready for her uh, her top coat, which is uh, anthracite gray uh, from Rebel. And uh, as you can see, nice detailing, uh, you know, nice light coat of primer. And uh, this will be applied with multiple multiple coats so that we don't uh, overload um, the acoustic tiling. Uh, what I do when I uh, just like everybody else, us modelers are frugal when it comes down to that. And uh, <laughs> I use Tamiya tape um, uh, to demark where uh, we're going to uh, the line that we want. Uh, three quarters, and up here it's, I don't know, what's the size of that? A quarter inch, I guess, five sixteenths. Uh, when we're going around curves, it just it's more flexible and so on. And uh, I finish it off with the blue painter's thing. I mean, no sense wasting good uh, Tamiya tape uh, <laughs> when all you're doing is trying to cover up an area. So uh, that's the update for now. The screws are painted because of the way that they fit in there. And um, they're painted brass. And it's just a matter of uh, painting the upper hull. And I'll show you the next step that when we go to do the lower hull, uh, there's some demarcations. Uh, as stated, I was not going to use the decals. Uh, I will try to use the decals only because coming back after. Okay, uh, it curves in. Uh, it's it's a weird setup. It's coming across like so. Uh, it would, it, if they don't work, then uh, I'll fuss around and and paint it and so on and so forth. But I'm going to give the decals a go and uh, see what we come up with. Um, that's all I have for now, and, uh, I was going to, uh, perhaps videotape, uh, the painting of the upper hull, and, uh, because of the proximity of the camera, and it's very, very sensitive microphone, uh, all you probably hear is my paint booth, so, uh, we're not going to go, uh, with that, um, I'll show you the, uh, the finished product, um, in between stages and so on and so forth. Of course, we're going to apply the anthracite gray, okay, and then we're, we're uh, I'm going to clear coat it, and we'll do the reveal. And I use semi gloss uh, for my clear coats, uh, Tamiya, and uh, that protects it, prevents the, the paint from lifting um, on uh, when you uh, go to remass the other area. There's a couple of little defects here that uh, I did while building, and I just decided to leave them there. I don't know if they're going to pick up on the camera here. There's uh, one there. And um, these acoustic tiles do get damaged, so uh, this is brand new, so, you know. I'm not too fussy when it comes down to, to some of this uh, detail. I built the sub because it had a significance uh, to me. Uh, Typhoon was, uh, although I uh, was quite surprised that it only uh, ranked as uh, number eight uh, submarines of all time. It was a ballistic uh, missile, a submarine. Uh, nonetheless, uh, 
everybody could guess that the U-boat, uh, especially the, the Type 7, uh, won as the number one submarine of all times. So this is uh, ahead of uh, even what the, the Brits and uh, the Yanks have right now. So, without further ado, uh, enough of me rambling. I don't, uh, I don't like to ramble on about uh, nothing. It's just to give you an update. And uh, we'll paint her up, and uh, we'll be back. Switcher, signing off.